This is the filthy type of tech I like. Yeah, you and me both, and we're not alone. Check this out. On my last video, I said work that algorithm out for me. Look what y'all did. Went from 13 subscribers, now over 100. Um, this is amazing, thank you so much. It's been a really interesting week on YouTube, to say the least, watching more views pour in in an hour than my channel had seen by a long shot. Uh, thank you so much. Really appreciate all the comments. We're actually going to use the comments as a focal point of today's video. We're going to get into some of the things that were said, mostly around where I said that it was safe on block, right? So people took issue with that and called me out. And I'll say up front that calling it safe on block is technically incorrect. It can be punished. That being said, what I meant was it's very hard to punish on block. That's the way I should have said it. So thank you to those who corrected me. That's just going to make this channel better. It's going to make me better. Please stay in the comments. Help me out. It looks like you went through my other videos. I didn't see anyone necessarily have anything to uh, say that I got wrong there. And that's not a brag. That's just to say I appreciate you looking. Um, yeah, keep that up for me, okay? So we're going to go into a few things. I actually got into a uh, conversation with somebody in a Facebook group. And, you know, he was telling me that he was going to blow me up or anyone could blow me up if I attempted some of this on him. And uh, what can I say? He challenged me. I went ahead and accepted the challenge. I didn't know at the time that he was a master Honda, but it turned out that's what it was, which actually was perfect, right? I need somebody who's better than me to be able to make the point. So we get in there and he knows what I'm going to do. And I wasn't shy about doing it. I put the... Uh, heavy punch run into hard kick out there for him a bunch of times and I'm going to show you what it looked like, okay? Um, in addition to that, we're going to look at some of the comments surrounding who I play fighting games with and who I test this on. Amongst my friends, you know, I got some people who have been playing for a while at a high level to say the least and frankly we got just the general people out there in rank who are pretty good so we're not going to shade you. I appreciate all of you being out there for me to test this tech on. Anyways, let's get into it. Alright, let's see how this comment ages. Especially that end part. Guaranteed. I know what he means by that, but I'll just point out that it's misleading. Anyways, introducing Grimy Dog. This is a player from the Facebook group that I mentioned. Master Rank Honda player who dominated in the set. That's not really much of a surprise though. Kind of expected that. I had my moments here and there, got one round, that was the best I did. Other than that, he pretty much did Honda things. But what we really want to know is how did he deal with the tech? How did it look compared to what he said versus what your average platinum player in rank would do? Alright, so get right into it here. There it is, he's got his minus four. Reminder, should be a guaranteed punish here, right? I think you know where this is going. And here he is saying, it's not real. I'll get blown up against a good opponent. Okay, mulligan. Let's look at another one. Kick him in the grill, counter hit him. Should have converted, but wanted this. This ain't it. I agree. You should mix it in. Don't only go to this. But once again, the Master Honda, unable to get there in time. Even knowing that it's coming. All right, catches that one. He wants it this time, look, look, he wants it. He does not want to miss it. Go for the whiff punish. I miss it, unfortunately. Serve it up one more time. Come on. Stop it. All right, so he did have some success. And I'm not gonna act like he didn't, but I will say that overall, he was about as successful at stopping this or punishing it or stopping me from doing it Bruh. as any ranked player in Platinum. I, I might have done it in every single game in our set and there were times where I definitely did it back to back. So he beat me, yes, but it wasn't because the tech didn't work, it was because He's a better player, and he forced a lot of errors out of me. It's 
So, anyways, look at this big master punish. That's not supposed to work against the master, right? Anyways, check out my other video. Serve it up again. No punch. Anyway, there he goes. Same exact punish as always. He's got some meter. He does nothing with it. Because the mix is real. It's hard to think of all that with all this flying at you at once. Standard. And you notice that I'm just, I'm just doing it, right? Like, I'm not doing much to mix that up. Anyways, enough of that. Let's look at who I test this against. Up first, we have my friend Pat, who you see at the top of this list from about the time when I met him in 2004-2005. He's been playing competitive fighting games for about half his life. Here's him winning with Dawson and Hyper Fighting in a local just a few years back. Anyways, let me know whenever you see a Honda that does combos like that in the middle of the match. Yeah, we've known each other a long time. He knows his fighting games, and over the years he's been really good at poking holes and the things that I think are going to be tech but actually aren't. Uh, you may have noticed in my descriptions I always shout out little Akiba games. Pat is the guy behind that. What's up, Pat? Up next, number four from the same list, is Ernie. He and I have only just become acquainted. Here he is punishing the run better than the Master Honda player did. But yeah, he and I only just met and he's known Pat for as long as I have basically. Grinding competitive fighting games like Virtual Fighter, Tekken, Third Strike. So he knows his way around competitive fighting games. Shout out to Ernie, AKA Anger Sponge over on Twitch. Y'all do me a favor, if you're on Twitch, make sure you check him out. Hit that follow button for him. I would love it if he could get a big blow up. Like he just blew me up right there. Anyway, yeah, he's really entertaining. He's a good player. Plays multiple games and multiple characters. All right, and a shout out to the Cami player. This is someone else who they introduced me to. AC has been a competitive third strike player for 15 years. He plays a mean Zangief as well. You can find him on Twitch under the handle Natty Daddy. And besides that, I play with people in ranked, and there are good players in ranked. So. If this tech had been problematic for me in any way, I wouldn't have shared it, that's for sure. But I just want to say thank you again to those who helped me make it accurate. I don't want to put out the impression that this is safe on block when really it's very hard to punish. That's a more accurate way to put it. I'll do better, alright? As always, stay tuned. Don't forget to click the bell. Got more coming up soon.